Hey Scuba Board, it's Ned Doc. Here we are at the 2015 Scuba Show in Long Beach. We have Mike Pellisier and John Hot, the faces of OTS. Mike, how you doing? I'm doing good. I have a good friend back there that's making funny things at me. You, you gotta love that, don't you? Dick, Dick Long, do you like right there? Dick Long, a, a legend no, in the diving legend. community. An old fart. He's the legend. That's what I said, a legend. The legend. The legend. Anyway, so Mike, you guys have been producing full face masks for a long time. As a diver, why in the world would I want to put on a full face mask? Well, there's, there's many reasons and benefits to a full face mask. Make a lot of sense. There's people that have TMJ where they can't bite on the regulator and they want a scuba dive, but they, but they can't. And with a full face mask, you don't have to have anything in your mouth, so it makes sense if you want to scuba dive to have a full face mask. It allows you to dive and breathe through your nose. We have an oral nasal in ours, so it allows you to breathe through your nose or your mouth so you don't get the dry mouth. Full face mask will keep your face warm. There's Air flows through the mask, it warms your face, defogs it. You don't have to worry about cleaning your mask, it's good to defog. Very comfortable. Uh, a lot of people like them because they're very safe. We've had reports of a Navy SEAL that actually got knocked out on the water and found him on the bottom. He was, they were able to recover him because he had a full face mask. Very cool. Yeah, very he cool. Had, he had a red there, it would have come out of his mouth and it was good to resolve. Our mask, we put a double seal in it, so if you have a a smaller face, the first seal catches you up here, and if you fall into the mask, the second seal will catch you, so it'll help uh, seal the mask on your face. Another cool. thing that divers like is we can easily remove our regular. So when you're through diving, this can stay with your tank, you can clean your mask up and put it in your bag so you don't have to uh, scratch up the lenses or anything. All comes very simple with a little button on the inside. Very cool. Uh, a lot of benefits. Now, one thing people probably don't realize is how easy it is to clear your ears, your sinuses, with a mask like that. You have built-in blocks. What we have here is what they call an equalizing stand. And the equalizing stand comes in seven different pads. So you can make it bigger or smaller to your nose. And all you do is you have the pad sitting just below your nose. And if you push up on the mask, it'll push up on the pad and you can equalize. But some people, like my daughter, she doesn't even use a pad, she just jacks her jaw and it picks his ear, but I can't do that. <laughs> I see John doing that over here, it's like... It's a luxury that some people have, and it's it's odd because you can... A lot of people that have to close their nose to Valsalvo, sometimes with a full face mask, you'll find it, that it, to work your jaw to equalize your ears, it works a little bit better than certainly having a white mouthpiece. Because you can open your mouth without losing the mouthpiece, because there is no mouthpiece in a full face mask. So it, um, it, Interesting. a lot of find it easier to be able to work your jaw where you can with a white mouthpiece they can't do it. So it's more like just breathing normal, isn't it? Exactly. Yeah, your, your, your nose is open, you breathe through your nose, you breathe through your mouth. Uh, the oral nasal pocket also gives us a place to put a microphone in for the underwater communications. A lot of people, there's a lot of myths and misconceptions about full face masks, that, you know, how dangerous they are. Well, the mere act of breathing underwater without proper training is, is a dangerous act. Uh, you know, so get the proper training. With a full face mask, it's the same way. When you learn how to use one, it's a very safe piece of equipment. And I would argue that it's safer. It, it is a little more of a challenge in an air sharing to have to remove the mask to go to an alternate air source. Uh, you know, if you, if you do run out of air, there, there's the three rules of, of, of diving is don't run out of air, don't run out of air, and I think the third one was don't run out of air. Or don't yeah. run out of air, whichever comes first. Something like that, yeah, whichever. The, yeah, but in the case that something happens, because there's other reasons that a person can run out of air or a doctor can run out of air, but you would have to train to do that. It, but it's not that complicated. It's not Russian roulette that a lot of people think it is in, uh, in, in ditching your mask, going to an alternate air source, pull out your spare mask and put it on. It's an easy exercise. You need to learn how to do that, and that's really, that's really the big deal. So, so really, to sum it up, it's a more natural way to breathe. It's, it's, it's nicer to keep your face dry, and it's just as safe as diving any other way. You just got to learn how to do it. I would, I would argue that it's even safer. And it's even safer. And the reason why, and this is one thing a lot of people don't take into consideration, is the ability to say, I have a problem over here. Whereas you think of all the diving accidents out there, you research all those diving accidents, and had that person in the past, they had the ability to say, I'm in trouble, I need help here. How many of those people we wouldn't be talking about because it's not an accident. 
you know, that they would have, they would have been saved and, and recovered. And, and, and that's a good point. It's because remarkable. with those same ocean buddies, yeah. you know, SOBs, it's hard to get their attention unless you can yell at them. Exactly. Just to be able to say, I, I have a problem over here. Uh, I need help. That, 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 when you think about all the actions out there, would save a lot of people. Excellent. Well, thanks, John, and thanks, Mike, and we'll be seeing you on the board. Okay, thanks. Sure.